We all know that Kylie Jenner always looks great, but she isn't known for switching up her look. Clearly, she's found what works and is sticking to it hardcore. We'll let you know what beauty rules Kylie Jenner always makes sure to follow. Before we break down the beauty rules, be sure to hit subscribe and turn on your notifications for more from the taco. Now, let's begin. A good foundation. Kylie Jenner knows the secret to a great outfit is starting with an amazing foundation. And no, we aren't talking about the kind of foundation you put on your face. It seems like Kylie and the rest of her siblings are constantly praised for their enviable figures, but it turns out they sometimes get help in that department. Kylie even shared her secret on Snapchat by posting a picture of herself wearing shapewear. That's right, celebrities wear it too, and they even buy it from Target just like us. She showed off her figure in some assets by Spanx mid-thigh body shapewear, revealing her secret for all to see. The best part about this is you can buy the very same shapewear as Kylie for around $45. And Spanx isn't this star's only shapewear secret. Many people have accused Kylie of getting breast augmentation, but she swears she hasn't. Eventually, she got so tired of the rumors that she addressed them on social media. The trick to her sudden cleavage all boils down to a really good bra. Her favorite is Bombshell by Victoria's Secret and it makes a dramatic difference in her appearance. With the right bra and shapewear, almost anything you wear over it will look fantastic. Skin Regime it may sound simple, but having good skin is key to presenting a flawless face. No amount of makeup can completely hide skin damage, and Kylie knows the importance of maintaining her skin. According to her, big sister Khloe Kardashian taught her to always wear sunscreen when going outside. Sun damage is a big worry for Kylie, since she has tons of freckles and extremely sensitive skin. To prevent the sun from wreaking havoc on her skin, Kylie has learned to be vigilant about sunscreen. If you're trying to get a glow but you don't want to risk sun damage, try getting a spray tan just like Kylie does. Instead of heading outside, Kylie calls up her local salon and books herself a spray tan appointment. She knows that the risks of actual tanning far outweigh the beauty benefits. Her second most important rule for healthy skin is always remembering to take off your makeup. Kylie makes sure to stock up on makeup wipes just in case she's in a rush and needs a fresh face fast. Her sister, Kim Kardashian, has admitted to sleeping in her makeup, but Kylie definitely doesn't want to emulate her sister in this regard. Nails. When it comes to her personal beauty standards, Kylie Jenner is someone who definitely pays attention to details. Part of what makes her feel pretty and put together is having polish on her nails. This is a habit which has been ingrained in her since childhood. While the rest of our parents were trying to make us eat our veggies, Kris Jenner was forcing a young Kylie Jenner to get regular manicures. Apparently, every single week, Kris Jenner would take both Kylie and Kendall to get their nails done. According to Kris, having your nails done is key to looking put together, and having bare nails is simply unacceptable. Once a week is a lot for most people, especially those with small budgets. But Kylie isn't most people. Although she didn't care much about her nails when she was younger, as an adult, they became a crucial part of her style. Her sister Kendall has even teased her because of her overly long nails and intricate nail art. Kendall claims to only do her nails for photo shoots, but Kylie always needs to have hers done. Sometimes, she even prefers to do them herself. It admits she spent hours on extremely intricate nail art in the past. Keep it simple. Most of us are used to seeing Kylie Jenner with a face full of makeup because that's how she presents herself on social media. But it turns out in her day-to-day -day life, Kylie prefers to keep it simple. Although she looks perfectly groomed in photos, Kylie admits she only washes her hair every three days or so. It doesn't get greasy, but it does lose its shape after a while. On those occasions, she tosses it up into a bun so her fans are none the wiser. When she's face-to-face -face with people, Kylie actually prefers not to go heavy on the makeup. She knows the difference between Instagram and real life and knows what looks good on camera doesn't always look good in real life. Those heavily made up selfies you see are done specifically for Instagram, not for every day. If Kylie gets her makeup professionally done for a photo shoot, she never wastes an opportunity for a selfie before removing it. If you thought it was impossible to maintain Kylie's extensive makeup routine, you're right. Doing a full face is so intense that even Kylie doesn't believe in doing it every single day. Neutrals. Many things changed for the Kardashian family when Kanye West became a member. It's easy to forget there was ever an era when Kim Kardashian was less than fashion forward. Apparently, Kanye just couldn't deal with all of the crazy colors and patterns Kim kept in her closet. He had his stylists work with her on putting together a more sophisticated color. While Kanye West has had an impact on Kim's sense of personal style, Kim has passed that down to her younger sisters. You've probably noticed that Kylie and her siblings tend to dress in neutral colors more often than not. While Kylie might like playing with her 
her hair or lipstick color. She knows that neutral clothes make her look totally chic. The whole family has embraced soft, neutral colors in a big way. By choosing nude, light pink, white, or black, individual members can stand out amongst their surroundings. But on those occasions when the whole family dresses alike, it does create a pretty amazing effect. Few families out there manage to be as color-coordinated and fashion-forward as the Kardashians. Kim Kardashian even admits to dressing Little Northwest in mostly black clothes to avoid overly gender-specific outfits. Beachwear in addition to sticking with neutral colors, there are a few other fashion rules that the whole Kardashian family is expected to follow. One of them is looking good at all times, even on the beach. We know that Kylie believes in sunscreen, but she also believes in leaving her bikini at home if she isn't looking and feeling her absolute best. It's inevitable that Kylie Jenner is followed by paparazzi wherever she goes, and sunlight can be less than flattering. Since she resorts to shapewear at times, we know Kylie definitely feels self-conscious about some aspects of her body. Having all your flaws illuminated in the bright sunlight, then photographed and splashed on the pages of a magazine, definitely takes some of the fun out of a day at the beach. In fact, one of the rules the entire family follows is being sure to find bathing suits that flatter their figures. While many of them feel okay in a bikini, you definitely won't catch Kylie's sister Chloe in one. Chloe claims she just isn't a bikini person and prefers to stick strictly to one-piece swimsuits. While this family believes in keeping up appearances, they're also all for sticking with what works sunglasses. This is another beauty rule that comes straight from Kim Kardashian via Kanye West, of course. When Kim first started getting famous, she loved all the attention she received on a day-to-day -day basis. She was happy to stop and chat with fans and was always flashing everyone a big smile. Apparently, this wasn't fitting behavior for a rising star like Kim, so Kanye told her she had to work on her public persona. One way to appear emotionally detached from what's going on around you is to hide your eyes behind a pair of sunglasses. They help protect your eyes and the delicate skin surrounding surrounding them from the sun, which is Kylie's greatest nemesis. Then there's the fact that if you're wearing opaque sunglasses, people won't be able to tell that you didn't have it in you to do your eye makeup. But when it comes to which shades to wear, Kylie follows her own rules and not her brother-in-law's advice. While Kanye may have insisted that Kim wear small sunglasses instead of big ones, Kylie doesn't obey any such rule. The perfect selfie. Some people are quick to throw shade at Kylie because of how many selfies she posts on social media. But we have to admit, there is definitely an art to the perfect selfie, and Kylie Jenner has absolutely mastered it. How to take the perfect selfie isn't a traditional beauty trick, but in this day and age, there's no denying it's a way to enhance your looks. Clearly, Kylie has a lot of rules she follows to get her selfie game perfectly on point. The first step is pretty simple, and it's to know your lighting. No matter how great your makeup and outfit are, you aren't going to look good if you're posing under harsh lighting. She she takes advantage of the sun right before it starts to set at around 4.45 p.m. or so. Then she will head to the backyard and position herself for a perfectly lit selfie. The next step is to know your angles. Don't be afraid to practice and find out which positions look best for you. Kylie seems to prefer putting the left side of her face forward and pursing her lips ever so slightly. Instead of copying Kylie exactly on this one, try experimenting to find out which pose best suits you. Athleisure. To some of us, going to the gym is the one time we don't have to worry about what we look like. Well, we might have gotten away with that in the past, but not anymore. Athleisure is such a thing now that it was even added to the Merriam-Webster Dictionary in 2016. This was a trend that was up and coming for a while, but we think Kylie Jenner absolutely mastered it. She signed a lucrative deal with Puma, which naturally led to her wearing a ton of athletic wear. Even though she was wearing sweats, to Kylie, that was no excuse not to look amazing. This trend is not only seen in selfies, but people wear it at the actual gym. Instead of hurting your feet in high heels and squeezing into uncomfortable clothes, at least this fashion trend is comfortable. And it can even be affordable, like this local heroes outfit we see Kylie wearing for $150 total. Denim on denim. There are some fashion trends that are only attempted by the boldest among us. For ages, wearing a denim top and denim bottom was considered the height of bad fashion. Many celebs have tried, including the trendy Justin Timberlake and Britney Spears. But Kylie Jenner knows that when it comes to fashion, anything is possible, even pulling off the dreaded double denim look. A lot of Kylie's style can be credited to her arsenal of stylists or a great selfie angle. But how she manages to pull this off is sort of a mystery. In fact, being able to rock this type of outfit may be in the Kardashian 
Kardashian family's jeans. Pun intended. It seems that many members of the family aren't afraid to rock this particular aesthetic, but if you're feeling bold and want to copy Kylie's style, we have some tips that can help. Don't wear different types of denim on top and on bottom. Don't match a dark top with a washed out bottom or vice versa. Although the colors should be relatively the same, don't go too mashy mashy with your pieces. They should be the same shade, but still look distinct from one another. What do you think of Kylie Jenner's beauty rules? Do you plan to try any of them out on yourself? Let us know in the comments section, then hit the subscribe button for more videos from the taco.